Hello guys, Earl Stott took a hit again. While I'm here at the bench, I just did a video on this uh, Reloading Basics ERS 2000 that I got off of Rob on Hamilton Outdoors. Thank you again, Rob. Check him out. If y'all subscribe to me and not to Rob, check him out. Rob's a very nice man. He's a fellow Kentuckian. You can't beat him, man. Top-notch fella. I was needing another bore cider. And I've seen some. Of course, y'all know me. I'm cheap. And, of course, most of them are all made in China. China, China, whatever you want to call it. But this is a field pot. I don't know if it'll come up there and you can see it. Weird name. Probably made by the same damn companies. And uh, what surprised me on this one is that it had this case with it. I wasn't expecting that. And then it also, hell, it come with, uh, it takes three of them batteries, but it comes with a sleeve that looks like 10 batteries, which I thought was pretty cool. And then here's, of course, your unit like most of them have. Got that unit, then you got your little dial dudes thing. You screw on there, and then you screw it, get it set right. Comes a little funnel here thing that you use for your 12 gauge or 20 gauge. It's got a little screwdriver here to tighten your little, uh, what well, I'm going to call nipples. I don't know what the hell else you call them. Them little nipples that spread out. It's got a little screw on the end of it, and you help screw it to get it seated to open it up better. And I get it pretty snug going in my barrel. I don't have to turn it too much to get it snug in my barrel. I use these right now. I changed a couple of scopes on my 22s. I was in the backyard at about, I think I was about 45 feet. I just want to make sure I can hit paper. And uh, it worked great. Really worked great. I did it in the early morning. And, of course, I was facing east, so the damn sun was against me. Uh, and it still had enough bright enough dot that I could see it. It was pretty tough to pick it up because i was looking into the sun but it still worked so it's not a real real bright dot you gotta you know what i'm saying if it's real noonday sun and you're right in the middle you might not see it if you're 20 yards 25 yards i haven't checked it that far i don't know what 45 feet there's like 15 yards so it worked good at that distance uh anyway guys i thought it was a damn good old thing i think it was total price about 20 bucks on amazon little case I thought it worked out great. Field pot, boresite. All right, guys, check one out. Oh, hippie loves you. God bless. Talk to you later.